Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today I wanted to share a jailbreak tweak with you guys that not only improves multitasking on the iPad, but also finally enables full-fledged multi-window functionality. Now, before I begin, I want to demonstrate this tweak even for those who don't have an iPad, as I think the functionality it provides is crucial to iOS and that Apple needs to implement their own multi-window app system in the foreseeable future, which hopefully they'll do with iOS 8. Also, the developer of the tweak, which is named OS Experience, was kind enough to provide five codes of the normally $9.99 tweak for me to give away to you, my viewers. So in order to enter, simply rate this video up and leave a relevant comment down below in the comment section. Again, because this is an iPad only tweak, please only enter if you do in fact own an iPad. And in your comment entry, you'll need to not only mention that you own an iPad, but also include your Cydia account ID, which is how you'll be credited. It can be found in the manage account portion of Cydia after signing in with either Facebook or a Google account. And on Monday, May 12th, five comments will be selected at random and the tweak will be credited to their Cydia account. So again, it's crucial that you include that Cydia account ID number. And finally, to preface, because this is a jailbreak tweak, your iPad will need to be jailbroken on a pre 7.1.1 firmware, which includes 7.0 through 7.0.6. Unfortunately, there isn't a 7.1.1 untethered jailbreak utility and for more details on the topic I'll include a link to my in-depth video on the screen now in an annotation form if you're on desktop version of YouTube otherwise you can find it linked to below. Now getting on to the tweak itself the first time you install it you'll receive a brief on-screen walkthrough and instead of highlighting that now I'll simply explain the tweak. So at any point a multi-finger pinch or spread will return an iPad with the OS experience tweak installed to the traditional iOS app page and launching an app provides a new opening animation that enters full screen view. From there, like on OS X, swiping up with four fingers will enter a mission control-esque interface that has desktops, which I'll get into in a second, and full screen apps with live previews, which can either be switched to or closed out of. And upon navigating to an app inside mission control view, you'll be required to pull down on it with four fingers to enter full screen mode or once inside the app swipe up with four fingers to return and then you'll be able to swipe between apps and desktops. Also, once inside an app, instead of swiping up, you can swipe down with four fingers to bring up options to close out of an app or to enable multi-window view for the specific app and then it adds it to the first desktop. And like on OS X, desktops can have multiple apps open which can be closed out of at any time, resized and brought to the center view. Now when in multi-window desktop view, the dock can also be hidden to expand screen real estate by swiping down with four fingers. And if it becomes too cluttered, you can either return apps you're currently using to full screen mode, or you can switch them to other desktops in the mission control mode. New desktops can easily be added and things can be rearranged as well. And quickly going over the minimalistic settings pane for the tweak, you'll be able to toggle OS experience on and off, as well as live previews for apps which can speed up and increase performance on older iPads. And finally, my favorite option, the ability to adjust app transition speeds. And while OS Experience has a slight learning curve if you're already familiar and have been using iOS for an extended period of time, the tweak adds much needed functionality to the iPad and essentially converts it into a multitasking powerhouse. So in conclusion, this is absolutely my favorite jailbreak tweak for the iPad and it's on my list of must-haves. Again, if you liked this video and you want a chance to enter to win a copy of OS Experience, be sure to rate it up and leave a comment in the comment section stating that you own an iPad and don't forget to include your Cydia account ID. Now, if you're interested in earning paid iOS apps from Apple's App Store while simultaneously supporting the developers of said apps legally, just be sure to visit freeapplife.com or bit.ly forward slash get free app life inside of Safari. Once downloaded, install sponsored apps for points and then redeem said points again for paid application codes from Apple's App Store, gift cards, and electronic devices. And finally, to be updated more often, such as when I cover things like tweets and jailbreak related topics, just be sure to like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And until next time, this is ICU signing out.